If they ain't got it, I'ma mask up and take it. 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 What is going on guys? It has been a while since we did a Mailbox Monday and as you can see I've got quite the stack of boxes to go through so I don't want to waste a whole lot of time. Mailbox Monday is back. Let's get right into it starting with the envelopes. Here we go. First thing we have something from Julio or Julio. Don't know how you're going to pronounce that one but I'm sure I'll be corrected on it. Lavigne uh, from New York, New York. So let's open this up. Okay we have a note here and it reads Hey AJ, what's going on? I hope when you find this letter you are doing well. I've been watching your content for some time now, and although I might not agree with everything, I still fucks with you. I discovered you when I googled all hope is gone clown transparent mask, and your face showed up, from what I remember, wearing the AHIG female mask. Since then I've been watching, included are some of the stickers I personally drew. P.S. What is the intro song in your videos? It is a Project Pat song called Mask Up. Uh, so we got some stickers here. Pretty cool, actually. He said he hand drew these, so there's one. Got another clown. Another clown. A Joey. Krusty. The House of Masks. Mask up and take it. And an I Hate AJ Good. And that looks like it's it. Hell yeah, man, these are cool. I like that they're on uh, priority mail things too, so it, it kind of looks like a graffiti type thing. Hey, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Next up, we have one from Jason Patty in Knoxville, Tennessee. Oh hell yeah! Got a little, uh, got a little Stone Cold keychain going on. Look at that. I will definitely add that to my little Stone Cold shelf. Thanks, Jason. I appreciate that. That thing's cool. Next up, we have one from the Lucianis. I that's kind of spooky sounding. Yo, AJ, I am Justin, I'm 12 years old and I love your vids. They inspired me to start collecting masks and I had three, but I'm sending you two. You didn't have to do that, man. They're both cheap and came with a costume, so you have to buy the costume for the mask. I hope you give them a good home. You know I will. My YouTube is called Blood Skull and my Insta is Carmen underscore Lucian 2005. What is your favorite mask? You know that I cannot answer that. I have way, way too many favorite masks, so. Let's see what's in this one. Just an I hate AJ good, of course. Let's take a look at these masks he sent. We got a rainbow clown, complete with hat. And we've got some crazy looking leather face. Looks like an off leather face, but yeah, definitely leather face. So hell yeah, cool man. Well, I appreciate it. You guys, if you have three masks, you don't have to send in your masks to me. Keep them, build your collection up, although I do appreciate it, so thank you. I'm just saying, build your, build your collection, build your collection. Next up, I have something from Zoe Kavakos. I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. Damn, there's a lot of stuff in here. Okay, first of all, I'm gonna try to get to the letter first without looking at too much. Okay, dear sweaty guy holding a camera, it's Zoe, for the second time sending in a package, I have some fan art, tech decks, and two things I hope will interest you. And she doesn't want the rest right on camera, so I'm not going to do that to her. We have a drumstick. If I can get it out of here. Can't really tell. This kind of looks like a used drumstick. But there's another drumstick. They're Vic Firths, and they are used. I just can't tell what they say. Sick-ass dancing skeleton lunchbox. I don't know if you guys will be able to see that, but uh... Nope. You guys can barely see it on there. That's fucking sick. Is there something in it? Got a little... Blizzard of Oz, Hot Wheels, that's fucking sick. We got a scorpion in a little gym, that's fucking sick. We got some fan art. I'll show all this at the end, by the way, up close. Chad Gray, Zodiac Killer. We got a wristband, House of a Thousand Corpses masks, official from Trick or Treat Studios, and then, look at this. All of the tech decks that you could imagine. We've got so many tech decks. We've got Blind, Santa Cruz, Flip, there's all kinds of stuff in here. I'll show all these at the end so you guys can see them all. Hell yeah. Thanks, Zoe. Appreciate it. All right, on to the boxes. First box is from my buddy Steve Nunez. Let's fucking open it up. I think I know what's in here. And I do know what's in here. We've got the Horror from Horrorland official Goosebumps mask. How fucking sick is that? I've needed one of these for a while to go with my curly. 
and I also need a haunted mask. So I am on the, on the hunt for a haunted mask. If you guys can find one cheap, I don't want to spend a lot of money on it because really, I don't think they're worth that much, but I guess if you're a Goosebumps collector, they would be. So yeah, the horror is definitely a sick one. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate it. He also stuffed it with some little Halloween body parts and a fuzzy pumpkin, which is kind of cool. So thank you. And there is also a glass pumpkin, a little uh, holder. You can put like a candle in there or whatever else. Hell yeah, Steve. Appreciate it. Next up, we have a box from Noah Henry with some guy screaming on the front. Let's see what is in here. We've got a hard plastic skull. It looks like it's been custom painted with a hood. We've got some Corey artwork and a note. Greeting once again from Awesome Inc. I hope you're doing all right. I'm excited to see your new house. As for my collection, it's over 40 masks and some of them are scores I never thought I would get my hands on. Thanks to you and everyone in the Hangout, I feel like my knowledge grows as my hobby turns into an obsession. It's honestly great that there are more people than I previously thought that are into the same stuff as I am and I feel a sense of camaraderie among them, most of them at least. So in this package is a letter, a pencil drawing of the Iowa Cory, and a stone cold action figure I had since I was a kid and a mask I found at the Salvation Army that I gave a custom paint job to. Please enjoy everything that I sent and talk to me anytime you want. Thanks a bunch, your fellow snowflake, Noah Henry. I didn't want to talk about the Stone Cold until I pulled it out of there, but yeah, I definitely don't have that action figure yet. So there that one is. Hell yeah, we got some Stone Cold scores on this episode. Thank you very much, Noah. I appreciate it, and you know that I will take care of that stuff. Next up, we have a box that does not have a name on it. So let's see what's in here. It's from uh, Los Angeles. Ah, uh, this is from my buddy Tyler. He uh, found this cool ass fucking ghost at a Halloween shop or Salvation Army or something. But how weird is that? It's like an alien ghost. And uh, it was only a couple bucks. So I told him to pick it up for me and he did and it's fucking cool. So thank you, Tyler. It's in really good shape. I've seen a couple of these things and they, uh, they rot really easily. So yeah, this one's still tagged and everything. Thanks, Tyler, appreciate it, thank you. Well, Next up, we have a box from Brody Warriana. And my camera died, sorry about that. I am super professional and YouTube is my job. So anyways, we have a package here from Brody and what he sent is a bunch of stuff, but I've got a letter here first to read. Uh, hey AJ, I want to start off by saying my band and I love your videos and the House of Masks hang out on Facebook. I would have sent a home video of us using the mask but could not for the life of me get it to download so I sent a CD with our first song, Six Steps to Death, and a demo song called Up Our Uprising. Hope you like what we sent. You can find us on Instagram at Dead Ritual Band from Brody, WF Dead Ritual, and add us on Facebook at Dead Ritual SWFL. And we've got a picture of them practicing, I guess. And we've got, this is the CD, I would say. We've got the CD here. And then I guess one of the masks that they wear. It says, I hate AJ Good on the inside. I think it got a little flattened out in that box, but uh, that's all right, it'll come back to shape. It's a little custom hockey mask there. Well, thanks Brody, I appreciate it. And I will definitely give that CD a listen to. Next up, we have a box from Brandon DeLeon, Coachella, California. Let's see. There's a bunch of stuff in here. First up, what is up AJ? It's Brandon DeLeon. This is my second time sending. Included is like five masks or some shit. <laughs> they are cheap masks. I've converted into what I think is a cool, which is probably shitty, LOL. Some masks may be too small for your face, so you can hand them down to Reggie if you'd like. Anyways, stay cool or some shit. I don't know. Be awesome and stay moist. Bye. All right, let's see. I'm gonna set this on the floor and just start pulling shit out. Um, there's shirts in here. Led Zeppelin, uh, like a Freddy, oh my god, an ugly Christmas sweater. Yes, I will definitely put that to use. And then we've got a bunch of masks, let's see. We've got, actually really well done, a Joey Jordison all hope is gone out of one of those really ugly, weird chin guy face masks that you see everywhere. We've got like a leather face style out of the same mask. We've got Iowa Clown out of uh, just a blank nail. A ghoul with like some uh, Day of the Dead type stuff on it. And we have, that's sweet. It's like the uh, purge mask. And that's like super, super heavy duty and thick. Well, hell yeah, man, thank you. I will definitely put these to good use and I will give Reggie one of them. I think probably the clown. That, that one will probably go to Reggie. There's just so much stuff, this room is full now. Next up, this one doesn't have a name, but it is 
Also doesn't have a state, so I have no idea where this came from. But it looks like it's been beat to shit. We have a note here that says, AJ, here is the vinyl ghost mask you said you liked. I have another one very similar to this, so this one is all yours. I've been collecting masks since I was just a kid, then got out of it and just started collecting again a few years ago. I have a YouTube channel where I do mask reviews and unboxing. The channel is called HorrorHound85. Check it out if you would like. It's awesome to see the hobby has grown and congrats on the success of your channel and Facebook page and business. Hope you like the mask. Keep getting after it. HorrorHound85. I think I know what mask this is. It's a weird looking screen thing, but it's like latex and long and odd. Yeah, with a white hood. Fucking weird. Uh, really weird, but I really like it. And I've seen a couple of them pop up. I wanted to buy it, but he told me I could just have it, and uh, I'm not gonna turn that down, so. That thing is very weird. Weird eye inserts, like, I don't know, it's, it's super cool. So, thank you very much, man. I appreciate it, and I will take care of it for sure. Next up, we have a box from Donnie Parker. We've got some notes here that say, Dear AJ Good, my name is Donnie Parker. Me and a friend are the owners of the Masked Up Legends. We have wanted to send you two masks. One is an Iowa Joey mask, one with our logo on it. Please tell us what you think and tell us how to improve them. Thank you for your time. Instagram at masked underscore up underscore legends. Hashtag I hate AJ Good. And also, I did something that I think would make you proud. I put you in a timeline project at school, and even better, the pick I used was the Satan cross with your face in it. Yeah, that makes me pretty proud. Hello, AJ. My name is Madison. I'm 12. I've been watching your videos for a while, and you are an awesome guy. Your videos make me laugh. I really want to make a mask. Maybe one day I will. But anyways, I just wanted to say hi. Follow my Instagram account, at underscore sugar45 underscore. All right, let's take a look at the mask. So this is the Iowa Joey, done on just a regular blank mail from Spirit. This is the one with their logo. It's like some uh, Joey style, but corpse paint also stuff going on there. Hell yeah, I appreciate it guys. Thanks for watching, thanks for sending in. I definitely appreciate it. Uh, and I will take care of these masks. As far as improvement goes, it just depends on what you're wanting to do. Um, if you're wanting to do replicas and stuff like that, obviously improvements are going to come the more that you practice. I've done probably literally a hundred Joeys in my life to get them as good as I can do them now. So it all comes with practice and research and stuff like that. So I think you're well on your way and I appreciate it. Next up, we have a box from Christopher Soto and no joke, this is how it came. So I guess we're lucky that whatever was in there stayed in there because it just fell out in my hand. All right, let's take a look at it. Whoa, pretty sick. We got one of the vacuum formed Trick or Treat Studios Myers that was made into a Joey. And it looks really well done. I wanna see this dude paint an actual Joey because that looks awesome. And then, why wouldn't you have I Hate AJ Good inside the mask? Duh. So yeah, dude, that is fucking sick. I'm sorry that uh, the postal service destroyed your box, but uh, at least you got here safe. Nothing seems to be damaged or anything. And that's dope. I appreciate it. Okay, I believe that I am down to the very last box. That was a lot of stuff. I can't wait to lay it out and let you guys see all of it up close. This is a box from Daniel Portels. Okay, we've got a note here, and it says, Dear AJ Good, hi, my name is Daniel, but some call me Bale as well. I wanted to send this package for a long time, since July, but I didn't get the chance to. You have inspired me to collect masks. In return, I give you a something mask that I can't read. Oh, a Gears of War Marrows figure and a Silent Hill DVD, because this movie has inspired me to draw creepy and dark drawings that I still make today. I hope you keep up the great work and mass collection. You're an awesome guy and a great collector plus YouTuber. Love and hate AJ Goods. Sincerely, Daniel Vale. Follow PS. That's my YouTube channel if you want to check it out. Follow the Silence is his YouTube channel, so make sure you go peep him. Let's see what we've got. Here is the mask. Nice and shiny. Here is the figure. 
Here is the DVD, which Silent Hill is one of my all-time favorite things ever. Video game series and movie, super, super good. The creatures and character design in that are awesome. So yes, I love Silent Hill. Okay, there was a second note, but I don't think he wants it right on camera, so I'm not gonna do that. But thank you very much for the goodies. I appreciate it. And what I'm going to do right now is lay all of this stuff out and let you guys take a look at this haul. It has been a while, so there's quite a lot of stuff. Sorry if this episode seemed a little rushed. I just knew it was gonna take a long time and it's gonna take forever to edit and upload. So I wanted to get it done and get it out because I know you guys have been wanting to see another one and I have wanted to get one done. I've just been super busy with the move and all that other stuff. So yeah, I'm gonna lay all this stuff out, let you take a look at it. Thank you to everybody that sent in, and if you're planning on sending in, we are going to get back to regular Mailbox Mondays every Monday that we possibly can. So if you wanna send something in, please do. I've missed doing Mailbox Mondays. I know that you guys have missed seeing them, so I really, really want to get back to normal on that. So yeah, that is going to be it for this episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed, and we will see you later.